hey, Keith, um, I know it's late. Uh, the girl I was going out with tonight got arrested for a DUI. So um, the Uber rates right now are like four times as much as they usually are. So uh, I'm not really having that. So if you could pick me up, that would be great. Uh, if not, that's, that's cool. I don't have any money. What? I, I'm not, I don't have any cash on me. Cool, me neither. But you have a debit card in you though. Look, I had a rough night, so I'm not really in the mood to talk about it. Aw, got nowhere to sleep tonight? Come on. No, I, I was just supposed to have sex tonight and I, she got arrested. <laughs> I have to hear more about this. I don't really want to talk about it. I don't even know you. Give me a pack of smokes, I'll hear you up. I don't, I don't have any smokes. Store right there, bub. Get something for dog, too. What kind of dog is he? Mutt. Got a little pit in him. What kind are you? Uh, let's see. Emotionally stunted 28-year-old virgin. I thought your breed was extinct. Well, hopefully they'll find another one of us. They'll lock us in the zoo like pandas and they'll make us mate on live TV. It'll be a whole media event. You know, China will get involved, stock markets will crash, the earth shall tremble. Uh, how, do you, how do you afford to travel around so much? I don't know, just hop on the rails and get off wherever we want. Where do you sleep? Find abandoned buildings to squat in. Seems lonely. Not really. There's four of us, including dog here. Cool crew. I can never do anything like that. Like, moving here was stressful enough. I don't know, I just kind of did it. You know, I didn't really think about it. You worry a lot, don't you? <laughs> All the time. Lately, a lot about my, you know, virginity. I just feel like it's never gonna happen. It's like this curse. Like, someday, I'm just gonna wake up I'm gonna be 70. I'm gonna be wearing sweatpants every day, eating TV dinners, and just, there it is. That's my life. There's nothing I can do about it. A couple years ago, my dad got diagnosed with cancer. Uh, we used to uh, work in his trucks together in the front yard, repair him and stuff. And uh, when he got diagnosed, he just gave up on life. And he stopped working on the trucks and he locked himself inside and he watched TV till he died. And uh, I decided that after he was gone, I didn't want to live my life that way. So I started hopping trains. I wanted to see the world. I'm gonna get going. Oh, oh, oh. We never called each other's name